You're here because you wanna make $100,000 a year trading Forex, am I right? Well, you're in the perfect spot because I'm gonna show you a very simple and easy formula that I have created that'll help every single one of you out. But here's the catch. This will require a couple of months of hard work and dedication. And the biggest thing that's going to earn your success in this industry as a trader is consistency. Showing up day in and day out and applying what I'm going to teach you in this video. And I promise you, if you put away all distractions and you just give me 10 to 15 minutes, I'll blow away your mind, one. But two, I will bring 10 times more value than any other video that you can find on YouTube right now. So stop looking at all the videos to the right side of the screen or the left side whatever side it's on just stay here for 10 minutes hear me out and I'm gonna help you guys out and bring a lot of value before we start if you guys do want to be mentored by me I do offer one-on-one -on -one mentorship but the only way to get involved in that is to book a call with me there should be a link below and I do host live trading sessions so if you guys do want to trade live with me every day on a zoom call definitely check out that link below and one last thing if you guys could I'm not asking a lot. If you guys could show some type of love, like this video, drop a comment below, even if it is an emoji, that's completely fine. And subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And also check out my channel. I have a ton of other videos based around trading that will help every single one of you out. Now, without further ado, let's get into this video. There are so many strategies on the internet in general, and I'm pretty sure a lot of you are already pretty advanced in this industry, and you just want a strategy that's easy to understand and easy to use that is my main priority in this video as well as giving you guys some golden nuggets so i want to give you guys a very simple strategy that i use for nas 100 and for us 30. it's very very simple i'm going to write this all out for you guys and it will make it a million times easier to understand now these are my times when i explain in my videos these are my times in california the pst time zone so when i'm trading us 30 let's write this out times to trade us 30 and nas 100 and i also by the way i have nas 100 and us 30 awanda so if you go right here and type in us 30 choose the one that says awanda and then for nas 100 choose the one that says awanda when you add it to your watch list so these are the times to trade us 30 and nas 100. firstly we need to figure out what time frame that we're going to be trading on. So let's start with the time. We're going to be trading at 6.30 a.m. PST. And the reason as to why I have chose this time is because at 6.30 a.m., that's 9.30 a.m. on the East Coast. So let's say 6.30 a.m. and then slash 9.30 a.m. EST. Now at this specific time, you guys need to understand that this is the market open. We do have the open of the New York session or the start of the New York session at 5 a.m. But specifically for indices like US 30 and NAS 100, we want to be trading at the market open, which is at 6.30 a.m. PST. This is when the money is being fluctuated in and out of the markets because all the hedge funds, banks, like this is basically when America is waking up. So if you look at other countries like Europe and London, the London session is going to be the time when all those countries are awake and they're all active. So it only makes sense for us, for the people in America, to be trading at this time because this is when the economy is moving and everything's fluctuating. So this is the key time that we want to be trading. Now, let me give you guys a hack. The time frames that we want to be on are the minute 5, the minute 15, or the minute 30. And let me explain this to you guys. Because at 6.30, let's start with the minute five. And I do have this indicator that I'm gonna give you guys right now that will really help you guys out. So go to the indicators and type in sessions and get this, this indicator right here, sessions, Asia, London, New York, colored. Once you get that, go to the settings on it. Let me refresh this real quick. You're gonna go to the settings once you actually get this indicator, okay? So we have our settings right here. And you only want to have the New York clicked, not the London, not the Asia. And then for my color, I have it in white with the opacity at 10%. And you can see this is deviating, showing us where the New York session is. So I'm a very visual person. I just like to see it all out. So the time that we're going to be looking at 
for the minute five is one particular candle and it's going to be this candle right here the minute five we're on the minute 15 let me go to the minute five okay so the candle that we're going to be looking at is this one right here look at the bottom of my screen when i'm showing you guys this this candle right here opens at 625 closes at 630 so as soon as this candle closes boom it's casino time that's when the market's going to start moving and we're going to be seeing some really big moves happening so there's like a grace period where the most volume is being like injected into the market and that's from 6 30 a.m to 7 a.m that 30 minute window that's like the key time when we want to find an entry so the first time frame that we can use and you can use all these time frames in confluence if i go right here and i can have two charts up at the same time so look at this i could have the minute 15 to the right side and then the minute five over here so i could look at the 625 candle go back here right here and then also look at how it lines up with the chart over here isn't that cool how the cursor like shows us the exact position that's on the minute five and the minute 15. so right here on the minute 15 once this 615 candle closes once again it opens at 615 closes at 630 so at 630 a.m once this candle closes boom it's the market open that's when we're going to see the market really start moving so one thing i would recommend that you guys do if you're real action takers and you're serious is go back and look at the past couple of weeks at these specific times with the time frames that i'm giving you and you'll see some really nice trade setup and i'm also going to give you like the ideal perfect setup that i look for that's really going to help you guys out so we can use these time frames in confluence if we want to see how the market's opening up cool let's look at the minute 15 and let's look at the minute five so yesterday there was actually a really nice move for wednesday and i want to see this so right here on the minute five chart is when we have the market open right after this candle closes and you can see the volume guys this is a big move right here within two candles it shot up 1500 pips yes 1500 pips this is why i prefer trading indices because these massive moves are happening all the time so this is something that i want you guys to understand is we can use these two time frames in confluence and what i mean by that is we're comparing how this candle is about to close on the minute 15 with the candle on the minute five and we're ideally saying okay do they have any similarities we can see this candle is bullish it's forming a v pattern and overall when you see like v patterns like this in the market that's signaling to buy and then when you see these a patterns in the market that's signaling to sell so we can see that we have this v pattern being formed on the minute 15 and also i am huge on candlestick recognition go and watch my candlestick guides that i have on my channel just type in like quote most stuff candlestick guides and you'll see all the top candles i look for but this is one of my favorite candles right here actually this is a spinning top so one thing that i like kind of use when i'm trading is there's a term it says wicks to the bottom it's going to go up wicks to the top it's gonna drop so what do we see right here ladies and gentlemen wicks to the bottom we have this spinning top candle right here right after that look at this massive push on this candle right here absolutely insane so these are the two time frames that we can start with let me just go back to the single chart so we have the minute five and the minute 15 ideally those are my favorite time frames but we have one more and that's the minute 30. so let's go back and look and guys instead of you scrolling up and back like this all the time if you double click right here on the right side it will always balance out your chart perfectly for trading view so we have wednesday right here uh, this is last week okay so this was thursday wednesday so we can even see we have this spinning top right here that opens at 6 a.m closes at 6 30. so once this candle closes boom it is freaking casino time so 
That's like the biggest hack nobody's talking about is you can compare one time frame with another and another and gain massive confluence and really formulate your bias, whether it's going to be an A plus, B plus, or C plus trade, however you want to do it. Now, the next thing, I know you guys want to get to six figures, and the way that you guys are going to do this is by going to FTMO. Instead of you funding an account with $1,000, $2,000, like some of you might think that's a lot. That's not a lot of money to trade with. If you're being extremely aggressive and over leveraging your account, sure you can grow it, but there's so much risk to doing that. And it's just a real trader is focused on account preservation. We want to preserve the capital that we're trading with. So instead of using your money, use OPM, other people's money. This is the way we do it with FTMO. FTMO is a funding program. You can keep up to 90% of the profits that you make. Cool thing about this program is you can actually do a free trial. So I would recommend that you guys use the strategy that I'm kind of teaching you in this video on a free trial and see how it works for you. And then once you're confident enough, you can go and actually buy a challenge. Like you can get a 50K account, 100K, 200K. So imagine if you're trading with $100,000 and you make $10,000 and you're keeping $8,000, $9,000 of that money absolutely insane if you really think about it and they have something called a max allocation where i can max out the funds on here up to four hundred thousand dollars so i could get four 100k accounts or two 200k accounts anything that's going to add up to four hundred thousand dollars but something that's really awesome with ftmo is they used to have a trading period like a time period where you had 30 days to make ten thousand dollars and now it's unlimited. You have all the time in the world for phase one and phase two. So ideally, if we get a 100K account, we have to pay $550 to take the challenge. Then our ideal like objective is to make $10,000 in profit, 10% of $100,000. And it's the same for a 200K account, 50K, 25K. You guys can go on the website and check this all out. So ideally, we want to make 10K. We can't lose more than $10,000 on the account and you can't go into daily losses and this is drawdown. So if I'm going to trade and it goes negative $5,000, then into profit, I still lose the account and I have to buy a brand new challenge. So these are the overall objectives on phase one and phase two, you only have to make 5% instead of 10%. Once you do that, you complete phase one and two, then you are ideally funded. And you get to, they'll give you a MetaTrader 4 login and you'll have your client area where you can view everything going on with your account, all the stats and everything like that. But once you're funded, they'll give you a MetaTrader 4 login, you log in, you have a 100K account, you start trading it. But then once you do that, you have the same things for the maximum daily loss, 5K, then the overall loss, 10K. So you need to keep these things in mind. And then the cool thing is that $550 that you would pay for to actually get take the challenge, you'll get that refunded. So now let's go into the sauce. We have our times right here. Muy importante. Now let's go over the FTMO strategy. Okay. First off, let's go over the lot size. And we're gonna do this for 100K and you guys can do it for 200K, just times it by two. So with the 100K count, ideally you wanna use a 20 lot. So if I take a win or a loss with, let's say a thousand pips, that's gonna be equivalent to $2,000. So ideally, all we need is five trades to pass phase one. So if we get those five trades at a thousand pips using a 20 lot, boom, we have $10,000 that is profited. And by the way, guys, I'm releasing a trading bot in EA September 1st. There is a link for the Telegram chat in my description. Join that right now because this bot that I have can trade hands-free for you and it can even pass challenges. So check that link out below. So this is the way that we're going to be able to do it with this strategy. And let's say that we have a 200k account. I'll help you guys out. So let's say we're doing a 200k account. 
we're going to be using a 40 lot and that is equivalent if we have a thousand pips win or loss that's going to be equivalent to four thousand dollars so once again all we need is five trades to pass phase one and you guys are smart ladies and gentlemen you guys can figure out phase two but all you need is like two and a half trades I'd say 2,500 pips to actually pass phase two. Okay. So this ideally is how you guys can scale to a hundred thousand dollars a year. Plus imagine if you're trading with $400,000 and there's other prop firms out there, guys, let me put you on with some more game. My Forex funds is another prop firm. FTMO and my Forex funds are the OG prop firms. Don't use any other prop firm. All the other ones are trash and they're freaking scammers. They have BS rules that don't even make sense. But with, um, I'm going to just tell you guys this and I'll end it with my Forex funds. Their max allocation is $600,000. So you could go to FTMO, get 400 K max it out. And then you can go to my Forex funds on the valuation and get 600 K and you have a million dollars in funding, which is absolutely absurd. If you have a million dollars in funding and you're doing 5% a month, that's $50,000 do the subscribe subscribe figure out <laughs> i can't even talk guys subtract subtract to subtract there we go subtract and figure out like what your percentage would be 80 percent, 90 percent, whatever it is and then yeah you guys are going to be making like 40k a month and then imagine you do 10 percent a month on a million dollars that's 100k then you take home 90 percent, 80 percent. that's ninety thousand, eighty thousand dollars. your life will be changed forever the information I gave you, it took a very long time for me to gather it. So I want you guys to take this information seriously. If you're still watching this video, you guys are awesome. You're the ones that are probably going to be much more successful than the ones that are seeking short-term gratification and they want the results immediately. Because if you do not have the discipline to stay on a video for 20 minutes, whatever it may be, then you don't have the discipline to go hard and really see results action takers are the ones that are going to see the results at the end of the day i promise you that but consistency is going to be your best friend apply what i taught you if you guys need help follow me on instagram and i'll reach out to you guys or i'll reach back out to you guys once you dm me hope you guys got value and i will see you guys later peace